So the final race on day one then is the Pri Ardatit listed handicap hurdle. Another two miles and one furlong. It's a 0 to 140, and the top one is Megan's Ziara for Craig Allen, Baron Scroop for James Shea, Christ Chapel, Daniel French, Lapazano, Darren Thompson, Yes Hollywood, Derek Hinton, Supernova, Craig Beckwith, Resurgent Gift, Paul O'Neill, Extreme Valiant, Martin Lidham, Bella Donna, Paul O'Neill, Fiddledy D, Thomas Rogers, and Regal Brave for Alex Cherry. That's your 11 then. And called in and away they go once again we're over these monster hurdles and making our way towards the first of them and there's usually quite a lot of them and this is 13 again in this and they're all safely over the first and there's a very short run to the second which they're all safely to the other side of as well so Bella Donovan will settle down into the lead two lengths clear of yes Hollywood in the pink jacket second then Baron Scroop in the dark green on the outside is third and the white sleeves of Lapazano fourth with the similarly white sleeve but blue jacketed this time Supernova behind that one then right over there on the far side Megan Ziara closest to us Extreme Valiant in the orange jacket then Resurgent Gift in the red and the green the two shades of green for Fiddly Dears they take the third and Alex Cherry's orange sleeves are with Regal Brave and the back marker is Christ Chapel in the two shades of blue then so they take the fourth and over that one they go and they're all safe to the other side of that as well with a leader Belladonna a good five lengths clear of Yes Hollywood in second Baron Scroop is third Extreme Valiant on the outside is fourth then Lapazano after that one with Megan Ziara and Supernova and Regal Brave then Fiddly D and Resurgent Gift and get back to Christ Chapel Making their way towards the next end, and Bella Donna is the clear leader. A good four or five lengths to Extreme Valiant, who's now been pushed into a clear second. That one normally likes to go from the front over the fifth, they go, and they're all safely over that one as well. And these hurdles might be monster size, but in the races often so far, I haven't seen many fallers. And Bella Donna is the leader from Extreme Valiant second. Yes, Hollywood is third. Then Baron Scroop is fourth. Lapazano is after that one, and then Resurgent Gift and Supernova. As they take the sixth, which they're all safely to the other side of, with Belladonna clear in front. Extreme Valiant second, and Baron Scroop, and yes, Hollywood, and Lapazano. That's the leading group. Bit of a gap then back to Resurgent Gift in the same colours as the leader. The back marker is still Christ Chapel, but they're well inside the final mile now, and Belladonna takes the seventh flight. That's the middle flight if you like and Belladonna is in the lead but only by probably two and a half lengths now to yes Hollywood in second as they take the eighth extreme valley a good jump on the inside now burst through to challenge for the lead also making a forward move is Baron Scroop Megan Ziara is creeping closer Lapazano also going well just on the back of those leaders but they're over the ninth now then and it's yes Hollywood and Belladonna with extreme valiant between the two Baron Scroop wide on the track then Lapazano trying to join that leading group is Megan Ziara as they take the tenth they've just got three more to take now that's the third last and over that one it's still Belladonna and yes Hollywood with Extreme Valiant being pushed along then comes Baron Scroop and Megan Ziara and after that one is now making a forward move Lapazano Christ Chapel is flying from the back so too is Fiddly D as they swing towards home they've still got two to take and they've still got three furlongs to race and suddenly Lapazano and Yes Hollywood have taken Belladonna on the turn it's Yes Hollywood is about half a length clear then off Lapazano in second then comes Belladonna back in third Megan Ziara Christ Chapel still running on over the second last they go and Yes Hollywood's kick for home Yes Hollywood's now Two clear of Lapazano. Megan Ziara is trying to come out of the pack. They race towards the final flight. And yes, Hollywood gets over. It's only a furlong to go. And yes, Hollywood is suddenly four clear. Yes, Hollywood from Lapazano and Megan Ziara. Is this going to be another one for Derek Hinton? Jockers didn't look over his shoulder. He doesn't want to hang about because Lapazano is finishing like a train. And Lapazano is beginning to get up on the outside. And Lapazano still is Yes, Hollywood second. Baron Street third. Then resurgent gift from nowhere. Regal Boy was probably last. Oh, Derek Hinton will be throwing his rum at the screen because that race was in the bag and the jockey looked over his shoulder and appeared to stop riding but Lapazano running on like a train so Lapazano takes it for Darren Thompson yes Hollywood second for Derek Hinton Baron Scroop for James Shea was third resurgent gift for Paul O'Neill was fourth and Megan's Ziara for Craig Allen was fifth